All right, so we just got to meet uh, Captain America, Rogue, and Spider-Man down the street down there. And now we're heading into this other store, which apparently specializes in comic books and collectibles. So it looks like this is going to be more of the same from what we just saw. But yeah, these are all like old school comics along the ceiling. And then we got like the super cool, oh that's a nice Spider-Man hat right there. I like that. That's the, uh, the black suit spider. And then we got all these, look at this uh, Black Panther hat here. That's cool. Uh, they don't have anything that tops the, uh, the cap hat that I just bought in the other store. But uh, yeah, more cool stuff. Here's a nice Deadpool hoodie. And uh, they got some cool figurines up here. Chan Chan got excited because we were told that uh, they had a Winter Soldier figurine over here. And it looks like somebody has already bought it. So yeah, there's that. And they got all sorts of cool Spider-Man hats in here. This one's got a, a bit more uh, Spider-Man stuff than the other place had. Now there is a figure. Boy, I like that one. And then we've got uh, this one here, and another one, and another one. And then we got a Hulk from Ragnarok. That looks like great. Endgame and a bunch of different ones of Thanos. Holy shnikes, this place is cool. And then we've got, uh, what's this here? Oh, I think that's a Captain America luggage tag. I might need to get that. That looks like a Thor right there. Lots and lots of Thor. Oh man, Eric, I hope you're watching this. Let's see if I can uh, get in front of him here. There we go. Let's see if it'll block out the light from that's coming in from outside so you can see all the figures. There's an Ant Man figure this big that says $400 in front of it. Is that true? Well, it's probably. Oh, it's signed Ant Man helmet. Honey? That's a luggage tag, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. That's a luggage tag, isn't it? It's a luggage tag, yes. Sold. No, no, it's not. It's an ID wallet. Oh, bugger. Sorry, honey. Oh! Captain America, Wolverine, and Black Widow. Can you technically use it as a luggage wallet or luggage tag? I would love to buy that. $28. No, it's okay. If it's not a luggage tag, I'm not going to get it. Yeah, it's not. Oh, this is incredible. Signed photos from like everybody in the MCU. Man, oh man. Did you see the shirt that I was talking about? Yes, I did. It's a woman's shirt. You wanna, just, that's why I said I like it. You want to get it? Ah, uh, I'm thinking about it. Yeah. Yeah. Marvel headphones. <laughs> I've been thinking about getting some of these for like uh, exercising and work and such. Everybody wears those at work. You actually listen to music while you work? I don't, but pretty much everybody else does. Yeah. Might make it more fun. Yeah, it might. Got these little ones right here. I think these are in the other store. Yeah. Hey, honey. Yeah. That cap figure that you want? What, the end game one? Yeah. If you have it shipped, you don't have to pay sales tax, which means it's only like $100 extra than the price to get it shipped to our house. So it'd be $1,600. Oh, is that all? Yeah. No problem. Honestly, I'd rather have the one that you saw for me in the comic book store that you wanted to buy. What? The one where? The one in the comic book store back in Oregon. That really? Or that one? Yep. Oh, I like that one. That one actually looks like him. Yeah, but I like the helmeted version, number one. And number one, I don't... That and number was Endgame. Two. You said you like Endgame. Yeah, but he needs to be helmeted and he needs to have his full oh, shield. Oh, I see. The Endgame uniform is my favorite. I still like that one. Oh yeah, it's amazing. But uh, not something I'd want. Fine. 
But yeah, we will get over there and film that here in just a minute. This is another shirt that I really, really like that I did not buy, but I still really like it. And there's the Captain America backpack. I love this. At the bottom, it's uh, what old school comics used to cost, 12 cents. Back when I was a kid, uh, my grandma would buy me comic books from the flea market for a dollar. Oh, oh that is, is cool. Did you see that the yeah, sign? I did not. I'm scared to ask how much that one is. <laughs> Deadpool on a little rocket ship, that's adorable. Hanging out in a kiddie pool. Deadpool versus Venom pool. That's great. Yeah, Deadpool, Deadpool fans, this case is for you. And there's, there's that one again. If we need a new one, you can come 185 bucks for the unsigned version. Ultimate Marvel. Wow, that's a cool looking book. And then we've got uh, Punisher here again, and Thor, and the Hulkbuster, and Hulk from Ragnarok, and who do we got over here? The War Machine, maybe? Not sure who this one is. There's the cool hoodie, and yes, I bought it. More old school comics along the ceiling here. Oh, here's a signed Luke Cage photo. Great Deadpool illustration. Nick Fury. And then we got a whole bunch more figures. Oh, yeah, and then these two. Ooh, I like that Nightcrawler figure. Nightcrawler's always been one of my favorite X Men. Trying to hurry here, our time is limited. But there's just so much cool stuff. A lot of this was in the last store, so I'm just trying to go quickly. Man, oh man, why can't we have this in California? Of course, who knows? Universal might not have this stuff for very much longer. Probably all this is going to be at Disneyland soon. It's all on Amazon. Oh, there's all, most of this stuff is not on Amazon. Oh, yeah, I buy this all on Amazon. Well, all that stuff, yeah. 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 Uh, not not the sweatshirts or the, the ball caps that they have here. You the uh, Universal? the Universal exclusive stuff. Yeah, go on their website and get it. I'm chasing her around that chair. Oh, that's a cool cage <laughs> figure. I'm just trying to stretch my knee out right now. Daredevil that I really like. I got, I got enough to walk on one of my calves to go up there. Oh, so I have Ghost Rider. That's I awesome. Like locker, yeah. And he's like all the agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. for those that don't know. I like that Daredevil statue. Uh-huh. I was just admiring that one. Oh, that's a nice Captain America backpack right I want the right Ant-Man statue. It's of scale. Well, not fully of scale, but it's not this big. <laughs> so it'll fit in our house. Can I have it? Is it the one that's signed by Paul Rudd that's like $1,600? Yeah, 400 Or 500 Four, One of those two numbers. Oh, there's a signed uh, Loki photo up here. That one really looks nice. Oh, I like that oh, one. Here's the Spider-Man case. I like that one right there. That one's uh -huh. only 60 bucks. That's a nice statue. Really? That's it for $60? Yeah. That's a really good price. That's a really good statue. I like it. I've Hold on, I'm getting there. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, here's Spider Woman. That one's also only 60. That's a really good figure. That's not Spider Woman. That's Did you Spider. say that one? That's Spider Woman. That is? Uh -huh. She's not a Spider Man looking person. That's. Why doesn't she look like Spider Man? I figured Spider Woman would be like a chick version of Spider Man. This figure right here is only 60 bucks. Yeah, that's a really nice one. I like that one. And they got some really good uh, Black Panther figures down here. Still can't believe he's gone. Oh, I kind of like that one was on there. Yeah. yeah, I apologize for the glass reflection on some of these. I'm doing the best I can. Yeah, this 351 in the middle is one I like. Yeah, so that place is open now. 
Oh, that one, 95 is not bad either. I oh, here's a female Thor. This figure is probably going to be a lot more popular by this time next year. One's only $60 too. A lot uh -huh. of these are only 60 bucks. Yeah. Good prices for some of these. Here's a Spider Gwen that's only 60 And then they got a Spider Man collectible pennies here. Oh, jeez, this place is cool. Okay, well, time's a waste, and I think I filmed everything. Let's get the heck out of here.